हेलो ऑल एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज चंद्रमणि पांडे एंड थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वाचिंग माय अदर वीडियोस माय वीडियोस आर एडिंग सम वैल्यूज इन योर डे टू डे इन ट्यून ऑपरेशन वर्क इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो वी कवर्ड डिप्लॉइंग माइक्रोसॉफ्ट 365 ऐप सूट्स ऑन मैक डिवाइसेस यूजिंग इन ट्यून इन टुडेस डेमोस्ट्रेशन आई विल शो यू हाउ टू डिप्लॉय इंडिविजुअल एप्लीकेशन फ्रॉम द माइक्रोसॉफ्ट 365 सूट्स for example if you want to deploy only excel word or powerpoint separately i will walk you through the process so to accomplish this we will start by accessing a specific url provided by microsoft that displays the update history for office products for mac os we can see that the latest as well as previously released history for office for mac from here we can download the pkg file corresponding to the desired application additionally we can also obtain the latest pkg file for microsoft intune suits like we can see that we can download the office suits with teams as well as the office suits without teams and we can also separately download the update packages for word excel powerpoint outlook and, and onenote for the demonstration purpose i will download the microsoft excel application and demonstrate how to deploy it as a line of business application using intune so to download this we have to click on this and we can see that it started downloading the application which is in dot pkg format i have already downloaded this same application that's why i'm not going to download it again and i have saved this application in the download folder now for creating the deployment we have to go to the intune portal and then within the mac os application we have to click on add an application and then under the app type we have to select the mac os line of business application and then we can see that the mac os pkg file is supported we can click on select and then we have to select the package so we have already downloaded the excel package which is in my download folder and then we have to click on ok and here you can change the application information let me remove the extension and the same thing from the description as well and then we have to provide the publisher so it's microsoft and then we have to provide the minimum operating system for now i am going to select mac os 12 and then in the ignore app version just leave it as it is and in the install as managed I'll not make it as yes and we can see that it's automatically populating the app bundle ID and the app version. And then we have to select the category. Let me select the productivity as a category. And then if you want, you can enable option to show this application as featured application in company portal and then select the logo i have already downloaded the logo in my download folder let me select this and then click on next and then you can deploy this as a required application as well as make it available for android devices for now i am going to make it this application as an available application for all the users and then click on next and then click on create now after some time we can see that microsoft excel application uploaded successfully and after some time if we check the company portal under the apps we can see that the microsoft excel is available for installation we have to click on that app and then we can start installing that app and after some time we can see that the microsoft excel application is now installed on the device And after some time, we can see that the Microsoft Excel application is showing as install on one device. And if we click on the device install status, we can see the device name as well as the installation status is also showing as installed. I hope this is an informative video for you. Thank you very much for watching this video.